Hello everyone, I am Tessellating Hexagons, back with some more Let's Play Evanescence, and um, I have my fan running in the background because it's summer and it's hot, but I tested the recording beforehand and it doesn't seem to show up, so I'm, like, I know how Let's Players tend to get really kind of, not, not funny, but like, fussy when it comes to background noise, but it seems to be fine, so we'll live. Anyway, into level 7. Now, there are at least two endings to this game. Uh, possi possibly three? I don't know offhand. But we don't have all the gems, so that rules out one of the, um, one of the possibilities. Now, what I plan on doing is showing off the ending for not having all the gems, and then I'll check if there's a separate ending for getting to the end of this level with all the gems, because I know if you come here, you get some, like, you get a special reward that changes the ending. So I don't know if there are three endings, or two. As it turns out, I was semi-right, semi-wrong. There are three endings to this game, but not for the reasons that I thought when I recorded this. Um, one of them you get for beating this level flat out. That's it, no strings attached. Doesn't matter how many gems you have, how many letters you have, whatever. Just beat this level and you get the, the normal ending. Uh, then you get the quote-unquote good ending if you get all the gems in the game and then do the thing that getting all the gems unlocks. Then you get the good ending. And then there's a third ending that, um... Well, it's called the beige ending, and there's there's a really specific circumstance that is required in order to view it. And I'll show it off at the start of the next episode, and how to unlock it and whatnot, because apparently it's not very well documented on the internet, but I, I know how it's done. I can do it. Um, but yeah, three endings, not for the reason I thought. Back to your regularly scheduled tests. So we'll see. Anyway... Where were you in the last episode and the episode the episode where I was looking for hands? Anyway, um, I don't trust that platforming segment, so that can wait. Also, I I should have I think in hindsight I should have been a bit more fussy about yeah the potato sacks. I should have been more fussy about the um the presence of background noise since Layer Seven's music is just um a heartbeat. But then again, we're we're in Layer Six now, so you know no problems there. Not gonna go back down just yet. I'm gonna see if I can. I seem to recall practicing this level the most recently, but then again, it is one of the ones later in the game, so that that makes sense. <laughs> oh, come on, you tease. So I take it we're going to spend the entire level looking for reversion points and then toing and froing between them, only teardrops. Uh, hmm. Now this says to me that we're going to need to have to come back to this layer. But no, sorry, to, to come back to the previous... The, the one that's one layer deeper, so the potato sacks can move and we can jump on them, because the way they work, I believe, is you can jump on them, but, like, you can bounce on them infinitely. That's that's kind of the thing there. Well, now we've gone one layer up the wrong way, and... Oh, that's a point, though. Even if I were to bounce up here using the potato sack guy, I wouldn't be able to hit the blocks, because you can't hit them any deeper than layer 4. You're still here. I forgot that you exist on layer 5. Well, this is, this is a veritable rainbow of layers this episode, so... The one time that I'm not bitching about, um... Uh, about the thumbnail not matching up with the layer we explore in the video, we have all the layers! Just every single one of them all stacked on top of each other, all at once, wrapped up in some delicious... effervescent bouquet. Oh. Well, there we go, back up to layer 4. That's, that's good enough for what we need, to be quite honest, so... Put, boop that up there. Oh, apparently the um the reward only spawns in layer seven. That makes sense, but I'd forgotten about it. And of course the aversion point is up there. I'm half tempted to to Blah. He says complete contradictory. I was half tempted to just leave that gem there and wait until we need to come back because I feel like we're probably gonna need to come back to um to layer five. We're gonna have to go back down the layers at some point, I'm sure, is what I'm trying to say here. And these clouds are probably the answer to that question that I was asking myself before. No? Oh, okay. I thought maybe there'd be an entire bridge of clouds stretching all the way across to this bit over here to the right. Because there's no way of getting up into here. Oh, I see that there's a little sprout here. I'm guessing that'll grow into a bush which then uses a platform to jump up in there. Okay, that answers my question. Never mind. Um, I'll boot these open. You're standing there so I can't get through, you absolute dickweed. Uh, I believe in this layer we can search reversion points, so that shouldn't be an issue. Um, those are like... Like, those are the same sprouts, they're gonna grow into bushes as well. The, the higher up the number, well, the, the lower the number, the higher the layer, whatever. Where's the next diversion point? It's, it's gonna be around here somewhere. Oh, we can get to this bit now, so it's probably down here then. 
This seems like a a location. No? Oh well, that's rude then. Well, clearly we need to be in this. We need to be down here so that we can boop the blocks and get the gems from within. But we need to be lower down so I can decay this and get those from beneath. Ah, game. Of course, we can't walk past these. Oh, here. Yeah, there we. I. Where? Uh, Tess, stop making noises and explain your fucking train of thought. I had a feeling there'd been a version point up here because in layers three and four, these things are solid. But there's no other way of getting up here. And clouds are clouds are now solid, so we can use clouds as platforms. Um, just thinking while we're here, what else? We can't go any further this way. Oh, but I accidentally found the letter. Well, that went well. So we, we, we've now successfully spelled Iversio. So spoiler alert: there is another letter. Um, yeah, another letter, another level. I feel like that's. I. Yeah, it's, it's going to be in the um because the reward for beating the game is a bonus level. Like you, you know the, the the thing at the beginning is like a warp to a bonus level or something. It's been a while. Just trust me. Oh wait, no, clouds are solid in this one. I was, I, yeah, fuck's sake, Tess. See that bush down there? I thought maybe I could use it as a platform to get up to this cloud and go through this way and hit those blocks and get those gems and whatnot. But no, because clouds are solid on this layer. Tess, why can you not? In fact, you know what, Tess? Can you just not? Can you just less with the derpery? Oh, you, you, they're not even solid anyway. You see, Tess, you should have learned this by now. You big fat purple piece of ass. See, clouds are solid. These things aren't. Tess, you'll fail at life. Now, where's the next diversion point? Because we're and considering this, like the one layer and the well, there. next layer, we'll be able to stand on this bush and go up this way. So therefore, we must be coming up on a diversion point very soon. <sighs> oh, there we go. It's up there. Well, this is actually going rather well. We've already got half the gems and the letter, so. What you know? What what could possibly go wrong from here? This is actually quite a fun level, especially after, especially after last time. Considering um, I didn't actually count manually. I just put in a a death counter and then just added one every time it came up. But I died at least sixty times in the last episode, so this is a welcome break. Not to advertise, uh, not not to be a subtle advertisement for the um motorway service station people. Um, oh, we've not seen these plants on on this layer before. That those ones that get in the way. And I thought they were just a, a unique thing to layer for, but apparently not. But yeah, now funny story about motorway service stations. Oh, and there's there's layer one which we haven't seen in ages. But um, yeah, motorway service stations, right? Uh, there's there's one here in the UK called uh, Moto, I think it is. And for years, I thought it was this creepy look that their logo was a creepy looking head popping out of a hat. But no, it's not. What it actually is, is um, is a guy with his arms behind his back, like, like behind his head, like you know, re uh, relaxing and shit. Because that's what a motorway service station is supposed to be there for. Uh, all these years, I thought it was a guy emerging from a top hat. Because I am an idiot. Well, speaking of being an idiot, we need to be, we need to be at least layer five to get through to get to those gems. So. And we need to be at least layer 7 to progress any further this way, because otherwise we can't bounce up there on Mr. Potato Sack Guy, so... Hmm... Well, yeah, because there's a bush thing here, which we were introduced to on layer 4. Well, yeah. We were introduced to in a level that used layers 4 and 5, and so I didn't realise they weren't a thing. You know what I'm trying to say? We met those bushes after they stopped using layers, um, layers 1 and 2, so... That's why that confusion is a thing. I know, much like Inception, we have to go deeper once more, because we're missing 16 gems, and... Uh, let's see. Brain, work with me here. What needs doing? Uh, we need to decay those bushes so that we can get stuff from beyond them. Um, and is there anything else over here that we need to do? Because I did say, I did say earlier on, we need to come back here to use that aversion point up there that only exists on layer, whatchamacallit, layer five, I think? It's either between four and five or three and four. I, th I, I want to say four and five. Anyway, uh, layer three. Where's the layer three one that takes me to the next one deeply? Ah, uh, I can English so amazingly. But here, what? You know, stick around, enjoy this lovely little warp tour of the, um, of the levels that we've seen so far. I think we've hit every block that we can, so just a matter of um averting and averting and averting until we get to um layer f yeah, we back to the beginning. 
Uh, we need to be on a layer where we can decay these blocks as well. A management is a thing that happens. But it's a cleverly designed level because it uses all seven of the layers, and that's you know, well done. Especially after this shit you pulled last time, game. I was about to say last edition, but that's that's song contest. I, my my inner song contest host is coming to the fore because on my other channel I host song contests. Plug 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 plug. Uh, funny thing too because we're actually like coming coming up to the results of one edition of that. So technically, if someone wanted to join, now be a really good time to pick a country, pick a song from that country, and then, you know, I'm, I'm just saying, now would be a good time to join my song contest because a lot of countries are open. But I don't know. Anyway, um, need to platform our asses up there, we can go down here, can't go, yeah, but, uh, bleh, but, bleh, 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 bleh. we need to do this on, on layer 5 so these blocks don't decay, so if we fuck up we can try again. Because any layer, any layer deeper than, fu that, no way, that still makes sense, fuck. Any, any layer deeper than this, blocks start to decay. And you're moving. Your lips are moving. Because all of Megan Trainor's songs sound the same, which makes me sad, because she's a fun little artist. Oh, I, I could use this Gulliver to bounce up there if I'm clever about it. But then again, I think maybe... Maybe you can't bounce off it from here and get enough height to get on top of that. Maybe that's why this block is here. I don't know. Ugh, game, you're being clever in my face. I'm not sure how to feel about that after last time. Where? Also, I don't want to jinx it, but I've not died yet in this level, so... That's probably still to come, because we have to go back down to... Oh, hello. You'd have to... Oh, hello. We're probably going to need to go back down to layer 7 at some point, because we're missing... Th There's the end of the level, you see. I I've made it here, and I've killed my only way to get high enough to use those blocks. So... And we're still missing three gems, and we to... Oh, I know which three... They're these three. We need to get back down to layer 6 for a minute. Well, and you know what? I'm feeling ballsy. I'm going to edit in the uh, the timer from... Okay, good. The, the, from, from the Eurovision debates to see if this actually does legitimately take a minute. Because I doubt it will, but hey, at least you get to listen to the crazy music. Um, You know what? I might as well just keep going because I can't... I, I can't! <laughs> you know what? If it hadn't, if it wasn't going to have taken a minute up to that point, it will have done by now. There we go. There was, th there had to be a death at some point. Um, right, you're alive. I may need you. Hold that thought with your tooth-ass teeth. Okay, so we're back here. Um, I may have been slightly deluded. Maybe, maybe I could just jump that entire section from underneath. But all the Glebers are back alive, so. If I'm wrong, I can still use this guy to bounce up here and everything will be K, but I'm going to check anyway because, you know, we're, we're, we're here for a good time, and yes, I can do just walk straight underneath. I made a big fuss about jumping up there for nothing, but I beat the level. Fuck! I meant to complete the level once without getting all the gems so I could show a potential ending, but you know what? This is good enough. Here, let's, 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 let's have the, the normal ending. I mean, if, if there is a different one, then I'll make mention of it, but... Anyway, we've finally rescued Princess Nehemma, and isn't she a beauty? Back up here in layer one. Ich habe mich nicht mehr so gut gemacht. 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 Ich habe mich nicht mehr so gut